all right guys so we just finished the park it was really really cool and right down the road from the park is this really old cemetery it's just called old stone cemetery area it's got this super awesome original stone wall construction there's a sign over there that says warning the graveyard of graves are protected by south carolina law tells you don't mess around no funny business no funny business no funny business no shenanigans <laughs> no horseplay serious serious business so no stealing or desecrating or doing anything or crazy because you'll get in some serious serious trouble but this is incredibly overgrown and it's just right down the road and wow, look at this oh my gosh this is cool this is the all original stone right this is all protected area how cool is this and how amazing would this be at night i didn't know it was this big i told you like no like pictures online do not do this justice guys you cannot tell how massively huge this is no not at all you know so this would have been from original maybe original chester county or probably back when the canal was still operating i don't know because somebody said online right that that one of these graves was 1777 yeah right year after the declaration of independence was signed yeah something like that. so we're talking pre-civil war we're talking basically right during the revolutionary war this was this was so uh, an active symptom. Wow. How amazing is this? I know. I told you then. Isn't this cool? This is so incredible. How often do you get to see? Um, like basically pre-america cemetery still like this pristine as just as it's sat for centuries and, it, and some of the writing is still it can be read off of these how amazing is this what does it say 1816 is when they died. 1816. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's really hard to read. But I'm pretty sure that's what it says. It's 18 something. Wow. Oh my gosh. And you see these rocks everywhere? I wonder if these are just unmarked. Yeah. I can't tell if some of this is uh, poison ivy or anything. So just don't touch anything with your hands <laughs> and this is all stacked stone look at these this is the cool oh look there's one that's knocked down right there is there behind that uh downed branch i'm so worried we're like walking honestly you'd have no way of knowing at this point do you see it though yeah yeah, there's no way now. Oh, that's definitely. Oh, what does it say? I'm gonna walk on the. I s the name's Margaret, but that's all I can make out. Margaret. I can make Margaret. Out. Margaret. <clears throat> I can see the last name, but I won't say it on camera. It's almost like a white marble-y kind of thing, like quartz, maybe? Maybe. It's beautiful. It's going to turn it down. It looks like yeah. the tree knocked it down. It's just years of erosion. Oh, wow, yeah, this one can still be read. Susanna. 1829. Born his life, March 3rd, 1841. Wow. He's 65 years. Whoa. Yeah, 1816. Age nine. Oh my god, 
that's so sad. This would have been the age of terrible, terrible plagues. Severe, severe mortality rates. Look at all these. This is incredible. They're everywhere. Look, they they're so far. Right. So this it probably means this entire area is all graves and people uh -huh. walking all over it. Because you can tell the wall goes all the way in the back there. 1827. 30 years. Man. Wow, we're so young. This is so sad. Well, um, I'm sure that both Union and Confederate soldiers are buried here. Revolutionary War veterans are buried here. This, there could be graves all through here, guys. So you can tell the wall goes all the way back to that back, way back corner there and goes all the way around back here. And now there's just walking trails through here. And this whole thing's protected so you can't come in here and do anything. You can't take any of this out. You can't. So there's an old stone right there. Colonel Robert Penn. What? Colonel Robert Penn. Robert Patton? Yeah. Really? Yeah. 1737 to 1807. I wonder if it's re uh, they're, they're related. Sarah Patton and Colonel Robert Patton. It has an American flag on, his, on the grave. Huh. Revolutionary War Soldier and Patriot. Revolutionary War Soldier. How incredible is that? That's either, I think that's 1817. There's a small stone there. There's a really small gravestone right there. You can barely see at this point. I'm going to go over here and check this out. Uh, see, there's all these markings. So, there's Civil War and Revolutionary War graves in here. Oh man, I wish I had my phone. I'm looking in like the real one and it has an eagle on it. Yeah. South Carolina Militia under General Thomas Sumter, Justice of the Peace, and Sarah Patton. Here's the 1777. This is incredible. This is absolutely incredible. He's. 70 years old at this point. So he was a Revolutionary War veteran. Buried right here in these woods, South Carolina. This is the 1777 one. I, want, I bet that stone is from then too, you can tell. Oh my gosh, look how this is. Years old. Look how this is cut. Right. How crazy is this? What is it, William Simpson? Simpson. Alas, the brittle clay. He liked the body of William Simpson. This goes on forever in the woods. This is insane. And every and every day, small ring. Wow. How strange is this, though? I know. Very strange. Very interesting artwork. And it's not even complete, so this has been broken. Right. Where did you see the year? Oh, down there. 1777. That is one year after the Declaration of Independence, guys. 1776. Wow. Wow. They're everywhere. This could be like just this whole video, to be honest. Uh, yeah. I can't even... How far back, like it goes far past where the eye can see. Alright guys, so... I had no idea. Alright, the pictures online are very limited. It showed maybe five, six graves. I thought this was a fairly small plot. There wasn't much here. 
and that's wrong that is very very wrong this is an incredible sight what an unreal experience it's surreal literally multiple generations of major major american history buried here and this is not like this it's not a huge memorial like this isn't cleaned and taken care of and maintained as you can see it's just all woods and there is literally a revolutionary war veteran buried right there really someone who died the year before the declaration of independence was signed right here when this was just a colony wow this is awesome guys this is unreal right the oldest the oldest the oldest that i've seen thus far is just early 1900s late 1800s you know oh look look at this one this one's all broken. Look at look how this was done. This is 1870. Tiny. Wow. Look how amazing this is. Just beautiful, ornate. And there's more markers. There's more grays everywhere. Everywhere you look. Right. As you can tell, like Kate's still over there looking at looking at graves as well. I mean they're everywhere guys. This is I mean, yeah, she's not lying. I mean this kind of look here and here. Does you see how far back, it, like it goes far past the eye, where the eye can see to that point. And the paths, I don't like the paths because it seems like, well I guess you're not, if you go straight you're just walking on the path so it's not, it's okay, it's not, you're not walking on anyone's grave. Awesome, guys. Wow. Unreal. And these are so old you can't even read them. Just barely some of them. 1832. And here's American flag here, so let's see. Confederate forces appears to be. Um, hmm. I can't see any markings on this particular statue. So look, this was set into this stone here. Which would have been here. You know, just step carefully. Over here. An anchor there. I wonder if this was the veteran. Died, okay, so died 1865. There's an anchor here. Most of it's faded, I can't read it. Must have been a sailor. Confederate Navy, maybe? Union Navy? I don't know. I can't really tell at this point. Look at this. Incredible. 1846. Kinda wish I had some water to pour over it so you could read it better, but... 
There's even more, see? Here and here. Yeah, this would have been the... <clears throat> This would have been the rear wall. Hello? You okay? What was that noise? That crack. <coughs> All right. That was weird. Feel really strange back here. I don't feel right at all. Ooh. What was that? It was like a doo doo. Stones way back there. Try to see the rest of this, guys. I know it's during the day, but I wanted to check this place out now just to kind of get a good idea of what's here. Oh, it's so sad. such an amazing piece of history to see. I'm so grateful to be able to see this and be able to share it with you all. At the same time, it makes me so sad because these are so old. That one says 1828. And not only are they just old, but that a lot of them have just deteriorated or got knocked down by trees over the years. That's an 1810. Oh, I really don't like, I feel like I'm walking on stuff. I don't like that. But I'm following a path, so... 
Oh wow, like people leave coins on the top. That is amazing. So this is the back side. And you can't really read anything on it, I don't think. I'll have to look back through and see. Wow, guys, this is sad. It's just that I feel this is an overwhelming feeling. Oh, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What noise? That crack. I stepped on a stick. All right. Actually, you can see. There's like remnants of stone in the ground. It could have been from a headstone. That's so sad. Can't even read this one. At all, whatsoever. Like, how, that's how old it is that you can't even read the stone. I wonder though if you took Oh, I can't think of it right now. You know those things you have when you're a kid that you colored over the stencils with a crayon? Like a flat crayon? Or like leaves, maybe? Oh, just the feeling here is so sad. But it's peaceful the same time. I just heard a man whisper. I'm not kidding. This isn't supposed to be haunted, but I definitely just heard that. Okay, I'm going to finish my walk through and I'm not going to talk. So I want to see maybe something's trying to communicate. So, But <clears throat> I want to be respectful here. Guys, I don't see Rob. I don't even know where he went. This must go even further back than I thought. I'm at the front now. Grave, grave, grave. This is incredible. Okay, there's the other end of the wall, I believe. I think this is the other end of the wall. It goes back over there. I thought I saw a stone out here. Someplace. Okay, so here's these.
departed this life. 1823. Looks like 1823 or 1883. I think it's 1823. A lot of women outnumber the men by a long shot. I wonder if that has issues with um, if that was due to the fact that well, the men were fighting, dying, lost in the Civil War, maybe taken by plague. Or maybe it was just childbirth. Like, why? I just have this sort of like, very melancholy, very somber feeling being in here. I don't know about you guys, but I'm hearing a lot of people getting this weird pressure in my ears. It seems I'm hearing a lot of people. I hear Kate over there, but over there, but I'm hearing a lot of people. Uh, the park is way over there. But there isn't very many people in that park, and I would not be hearing them all the way over here. Definitely footsteps out in the woods, but that could just be deer or other animals. Oh man. It's getting dark. Yeah, 1818. 1818. So we're talking like pre-Civil War, post-Revolutionary War. spider webs but in fairness I am in the woods so I but. found you is there more back there oh yeah wow oh yeah over here I think this is a bee's nest a what there's a bee's nest in there because <clears throat> I just heard them really loud when I walked I because I just walked over here and then I just looked oh, and really? I saw one in there so this tree fell right uh-huh but there's graves right there. Like it fell on top of the graves. Wow. Isn't that awful? Yeah, I heard something over there. I wonder if there's more. This is the out, this is the wall. Have you heard anything? Because I have. Yeah. Yeah, I have. Whoa, look at these. Yeah. These are huge. Obviously, that's one from one that fell. If you look in the middle there, there's more in there, too. They're just everywhere. I don't think oh, you can yeah. avoid not walking. I don't know. Or avoid walking. No, there's there. nothing you can do. There isn't. But I'm just trying to follow the path, you know? But I noticed right here. 
I heard something that just sounded like a kid. I swear it sounded like I heard like a, like a cannon firing or like a musket. It was like, doof, doof. yeah. So I don't know. I heard a whisper. I heard a woman. A man. This isn't supposed to be what this is about, but it just happened. This is incredible. You hear that? I heard it again. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a child. Yeah, it's so weird. What is it? I don't know. There's a farm across the street, but the house of that farm is way over there. Yeah, there's nobody outside. It's like way down. What the? This is a baby, a four-year-old. Do you think that's what we were hearing? It sounded about that age, right? Look, someone left money on top. Doesn't what does that mean? It's a dedication to the dead. It's, it's wow. I saw this before, but I didn't notice the date on it. That's why it's so small. Yeah, there's quite a few of them in here. When I walked up to the front, I got really emotional. That one's complete, you can't even make it out anymore. And I'm wondering if they'll just the little ones are children. It's possible they could be lesser income folks. There's huge headstones up there, but I, I'm scared to like walk on top of someone's grave and be disrespectful, you know? But I, do you remember learning about, um, was Robert Patton? Is that was the name, right? Was Colonel Patton, Robert Patton? General in World War II, so I wonder if Oh, I okay. Him. Either way, it was a colonel. You can see there's like pieces of stuff everywhere. It's so sad. You're talking everywhere. I went that way the last time, so I'm gonna go this way this time. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so I'm back. Um. Yeah, I can't believe I've been back here that long. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Eighteen twenty four to eighteen seventy five Elizabeth Walker. Rest in peace. Here's another little one, you guys. I'm scared, I feel so scared to even look. I can only make out a letter right here. I think I'm touching poison ivy. Crap. It's impossible. It's, it looks almost fully smooth.
You hear music? Someone singing? I should have run. No, I hear it. I hear it. Child back there and a man singing right there. I'm actually getting a little bit of a headache. Like my ears kind of hurt. Like when I walked up to the front, when you were way back there, I got really emotional and started crying for no reason. This is so incredible. I'm sorry I keep saying it, but it really is. And sad. Whim. Forty-two fell and fell a martyr to the cause of his country at Freedom or Fredericksburg, Virginia, or yeah, on the twenties. Or something. December 1862. Wow. 1913. of a war veteran. R.C. Stevenson, a soldier, Palmetto Sharpshooters, SCW. 1865, he was born in 1834, died in 1910. Gone but not forgotten. Robert G. Stevenson, Sergeant, South Carolina Troops of War, in 1910.
is incredible. Isn't it? All right, guys. Uh, probably going to end up heading out. It's getting dark. We still have to go home and do a bunch of other things. But I think this might be even worth if If we can maybe talk to them, make sure they're cool with it. Because um, there's a house way down there and a couple houses on this road. Because uh, people live on this road. If they're cool with, uh, you know, us being out here doing an investigation, this would be amazing. Right. Amazing at night. It would just be so... Did you hear that? So, so I heard a child. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've heard children. I've heard guys yelling. I've heard what sounded like muzzle shots. I've I've or cannon shots. I've heard what sounded like men screaming out here. Of what I've heard uh, footsteps. I've heard like almost women. Like sounds like women uh, I just heard a woman sighing or moaning. You. When you yeah. over, I just heard it again. Hello. So yeah, a lot of history here. Very creepy place. Hearing a lot of voices. This one, I just saw somebody walk over there. Really? And it looked like they were wearing white. No. Yeah, maybe it was just the trick of light reflecting off my car because my car is over there, but. It had to have been. I just heard a man yelling again. You hear it, right? Yeah, it's like echoing like almost like around here. Yeah. Crazy. There's just a constant voice. Right. Like conversation, like constantly. Yeah. So, this isn't far from us, so I think we might try to come back here at night at some point but I wanted to check this out since I, I, I realized online just today that this was here we ended up being here all day so this is going to be its own video uh, not all day but we ended up being here quite a long time so this is going to be a whole separate video um, entirely and uh, this is amazing this is really really cool really really cool such a just an insane piece of American history and uh, just made it before my my last battery died that's the other reason why we got to get out of here we can't stay any later because i don't have any more batteries or my flashlights didn't think we we're going to be out here this late <laughs> oh well we'll plan better next time but this isn't far from us so i think we might have to come down here this is amazing this is so cool i mean civil war revolutionary war how cool is that i don't know what do you think eh? it's amazing. It amazing man Cool place. And I didn't come here for anything haunted, but I'm, I'm telling you, I'm right. pretty sure I'm still. I got, I got a real bad cough back there. I heard a cough too. Like, I mean, I had, I coughed. Oh, okay. Like, well, I got a really bad that. cough all of a sudden, like it was hard to breathe. Oh, geez. Just after that, I heard like what sounded like, like muzzle loader shots or cannon shots or something. I don't know. I don't even know if this was the original entrance way. It doesn't look like it. it I don't know. Yeah. But it's, it's all falling apart, so this may have just been a break in the wall at this point. I don't know. Does it go, how far back does it go? All the way back there. Really? Yeah. Behind the gate thing? Uh-huh. Yikes. Yeah. Wow. Well, on this side, there's no, that's not there. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's on this side back So there. it's separating the property. Right. Because I, I think technically all that back there is uh, parkland. Oh. So I don't know. Okay. Anyway, guys, as you can see, it's getting dark. My little battery thing he's blinking i'm about to die yeah it's uh, crazy it looks yeah. bright but it's not no. the camera always makes it look so much brighter right. than it is. pretty dark so that, uh, we only have the one flashlight because i didn't bring any so ah <sighs> too bad i wish we had another battery that would stay a little bit longer but Please no can do no can do so Thanks so much for watching guys yeah it's so much fun to do so much fun so much fun two for one special Anyway, guys, much love to you all. Comment, like, subscribe. And as always, stay strong. Stay blessed.
stay savage. Peace. Peace.